Hi Leo, here's a general look at your solar chart for May 2010. Now, this month, um, I think you're going to care a little bit more about what others, how others see you. Um, you may be asking yourself, is it time for me to put myself across in a different kind of a way? Uh, or wishing that you could. Uh, or you may be striving to project your public image to those in authority. Uh, maybe there's going to be more red tape, more, more bureaucracy. Just anybody who is important to the overall master plan uh, at the moment. So you want to put yourself or something you stand for maybe in the best light possible. Another way this can work is that you may feel more sensitive than usual uh, to others' opinions uh, of your public persona, really. Uh, you know, you may feel as though, as though you're being scrutinized in some way. Uh, or maybe you're feeling that you need to come up to some sort of a standard for them, but more importantly, for yourself. So whether you're being examined on something or whether you are attempting to attract more or a different kind of attention from the world out there, either way, it seems to mean that you're, you're just going to care more about what others think over the period up until the 20th. So it's definitely a favourable time for you to develop um, your image, but also for business links, career goals, any strategy which can improve your status. Reputation, presentation will be, be more on your mind at the moment, I think. New contacts are likely. Uh, social life looks very active, warm, friendly. Um, networking, all communication activities, uh, over the wires as well. But underpinning some of this, there is at least initially the hope of making maybe a good impression or a better impression, getting people on side maybe, uh, promoting something maybe. Another manifestation of the energy may be that you also feel a camaraderie, a real friendship, a kinship, uh, with someone, a mental rapport with others, and uh, you're making closer contact with those others or that person. Uh, again, it could be over the wires or, in, you know, within your community, uh, within your tribe. And um, these people uh, will mean something to you. Um, now, group orientated activities are highlighted and you should feel supported by people uh, within the group, in the tribe. Uh, there's a feeling of working cooperati co cooperatively with others on a sort of a mental level. This one mindedness, this coming together of, of different um, persuasions and um, opinions and uh, beliefs. Um, and, and this uh, type of group dynamic will exist probably more behind the scenes, like a sort of a closed circle. Um, could even be some sort of elite. Now, overall, you'll be feeling more assertive and decisive with Mars in your sign. Uh, Mars uh, can help with your stamina, which is useful for getting new things uh, up and running in your life, but also to provide you with more buoyancy to help with any health related problem or any you know difficult project that you've got to do. Mars has been there since last October. Uh, now the flip side of Mars, of course, uh, rules accidents, fevers, infections of the blood. It rules the blood actually. Um, sharp instruments, surgery, etc. And some of you may have experienced more uh, um, in those areas uh, since uh, Mars, the red planet, uh, went into your sign uh, from last October, and Mars will be there until June the 6th. Uh, but anything about uh, being assertive, uh, decisive, pushing forwards with things in your life, uh, any area of your life will be helped by having Mars in your sign, as long as you keep the energy in balance. Um, and um, Material matters like money, your space, the things that belong to you or something that you'd like to uh, get a hold of. Uh, now, that's going to be where you're working the hardest at the moment. 
there may have been a marked lack of comfort in the past or funding or income or maybe you're trying to improve uh, your health or, uh, as the physical body is actually the personal space we walk around in and um, you may want to scrutinize just what is it that's holding you back or maybe you found the thing that could help improve your situation. So you just got to keep plugging away at that. Keep plugging away. Um, and um, look beyond maybe uh, present material or physical discomfort. Uh, and, you know, it, it needs strength from you. Uh, it needs perseverance from you. And, and, and of course, a realistic attitude. Uh, now, the hardest thing sometimes is to work with what is uh, and not perhaps how we'd like it to be. And it may be that you need to galvanize yourself into taking the steps necessary to deal with your particular area of material lack or physical discomfort. Get, you know, get control, get behind the, the driving wheel or the steering wheel. Um, and just know that determination, determination and consistency uh, wins the day here because uh, results will be, will be slow in coming. So you've got to hang in there. Building strong foundations is a keynote uh, at the moment for you, Leo, um, in those quite physical material areas. But your hard work and self-discipline is going to stand you in good stead in the, in the future. Changes are happening, uh, but there's an element uh, which you may feel is a little out of your control, um, and that relates to this material physical area. The control may seem to rest with the powers that be, or in the lap of the gods, or maybe with some big organization. Um, could even be a partner or other sort of outside agency. Um, and you may have to rely or, or you have had to rely on a research source which is uncertain in some way or unpredictable in some way or a person who is um, not reliable um, or aspects of your comfort zone relies on somebody else. Um, and this, there may be this uncertain feeling here, but also understand that meeting the challenges of change in your material security setup or your physical well-being uh, situation in a realistic, patient and shrewder way will be successful if you take the long view uh, and keep looking to the future. In fact, there could be good news here as positive change could bring a definite improvement in the area of um, a colleague's or a partner's finances shared property or other joint endeavor. So if you're pooling resources with somebody else, that's going to be where you, you do well. That's going to be the area that will uh, bring most rewards. From the 20th, friendships, group connections and other contacts will be important to you and you'll have a, a stronger sense of community then and you should benefit from the input of the group mind. Uh, networking will be highlighted and um, uh, definitely a time for you to work in a team, put your head together with others and uh, learn from each other. And that's it for May. Um, it can be useful to listen to the rising sign. It throws a different light, a new light on what I've said here. And I'll see you again the next time.